Datasher. Nice ball. Picks out Mane. Mane onto his left foot. Then his right still going. And into the back of the goal for Pablo Dukai. It's three goals in two games. He had a little bit of a gambling magic in there, I think. It's the all Gambian goal. Mane to Ka. I couldn't believe it. I just said. Maybe you couldn't believe it. I show you that every day when we play 5v2. It's 5v2. This is a goal. Yeah, but that's the reason you play 5v2. Okay, that's true. Here comes Kakuta Mane, and now it's a 3v1 for the Whitecaps. Kakuta Mane, he's got options left. Mane himself, Kakuta Mane! It's his fifth of the season. He has a natural gifted talent. He can pretty much play any team he wants. It's an honor to get called by the national team. I was very flattered, but I have a family here and uh, I was adopted. I will get my citizenship 13 months from now. To play for the US national team would be great. I spoke to you numerous times about Kakuta and you know, do I think he would be able to help the national team get to the next level and without a doubt I do. He's got natural ability, but we're also trying to teach him what it takes to be a professional and live in your life correctly. The nutrition, the hydration, the rest and the recovery, the tactical, the technical side. He's bought into that very well, especially this year. And you see the results of the way he's maturing as a person. As soon as I get my passport, I think I will be, you know, I'll be ready. Here they come, Manny, Kakuna Manny, running at it. Like we wear, we wear our hearts out on our sleeves. So my first natural reaction is because I consider him as my little brother, so I don't want him to get in trouble. I was just telling him in our language, listen, it's better that you show him off by dribbling, scoring a goal rather than to go in the fight because that's a battle you're gonna lose anyway. You know, even though they play, they're on a you know different team. Just hearing that just calms you down. The next moment he almost scored, so. In my back of my mind, I was like, why did I give him the advice? <laughs> Considering that it's your opening. But you know, at that moment, you think like, oh, he's family, you know, you want to help him, you don't want nothing to happen, you know. Pa calmed the situation down. I was grateful. I did remember that, and that's what made me think long and hard about bringing him here, not just to help on the, on the football field, but also help off the football field and the growth of his development, which proved at that moment as well. I was really excited, you know. I was so happy. I talked to coach and it's like, you know. You never told me this. I, why would I tell you that, see? Oh. Hello, baby. Come here, you come here. Okay, talk to your uncle. <laughs> come, slap him. Hello, baby. Yeah, yeah come, 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 come. I'm cooking tonight because um, Normally, Pa would have made African food, but uh, it's too heavy. It's way too heavy for a um, day before game. Pa's not playing uh, tomorrow due to his um, cheekbone fracture, but uh, since Kakura is playing, um, he needs a good meal before the game. When we played against Kansas, it was second half, and uh, Dom Dwyer he got a big head, African <laughs> big head, and this size. I thought I, was, I had a strong African head, but I guess not. So we just clash some heads and I got the worst of it. So I got a broken cheekbones. Thanks, Dom. You want me to cut it or not? No, you don't need to. You sure? <laughs> yeah, I'll eat it like that. <laughs> they are treating me like I'm still a kid who don't know how to eat because, uh, because my cheekbone is destroyed. I've been feeling sorry for you this past three days. Because wow. it's like taking care of two babies. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I knew that. I had to take care of him at practice too. Why are you laughing? Uh, because I know it's true. Is she taking care of three babies? <laughs> I understand. Who is the other one? He's sitting right next over. 
right you next over. Yeah, you should write uh, listen to that woman. <laughs> <laughs> listen to that woman. This was the one, my Gambian brother, who took very care of us. A very wonderful human being. That has to be said. Thank you. Even though he's bald, but he's all right. You see this? <laughs> you can have a brother that you never met before in, the, in your entire life, but within a couple of weeks, it's just like natural family. And it's the same that we have, that I had with him, and it's the same that I have with him. Ernie, yesterday's scooter was over. Now I trust him as a babysitter. Really? Yeah, I trust hey, him as hey, a babysitter. Hey, hey, don't listen to him. I don't. No, That's I trust never him. never gonna happen. I'm I trust him as a babysitter. I'm not your babysitter. They're an interesting dynamic, these two. Uh, an older, experienced player, been in Europe, great professional, great honest person. Kakuta beginning his football journey two or three years now out of the draft uh, as a young talented player and both have a lot of respect for each other, both push each other a lot. They have a good relationship, um, we all have good relationships. This team's chemistry is the best I've been on. They add to that and having similar backgrounds I think it, it really brings uh, them closer together and the whole team because we kind of bond over that. I love their teammates too, every single one, the great people. I've been around this club for, for a while, but this group of guys, they're, they're something special. It's a dysfunctional family. <laughs> We are the youngest team in Major League Soccer, we know that. That's why the experienced players are so crucial. He's got a high football intelligence. His game awareness is brilliant. That's a great, great thing to have, and we're lucky to have that. He's my big brother. You know, a brother that I've never had. He's been looking out for me, and he's my roommate on the road, so I get to spend a lot of time with him, which, um, it's fun. Most of the time, it's fun. Just when you're sleeping. <laughs> Mesquita, free header for Waston. Carl with the shot. It's the opening goal of the game. And Pa Modakar shocks Seattle early on. Mane is a good option, short. And to Gerard. Carr. It's another for the central defender from another set piece. Who would have put any money on this? Cheeky little back heel from the center back. That is, that is kind of crazy though. I never scored in my professional life. Two goals in one game. That was a great achievement. And, and the dancing when he scores, and you see him trying to set his dance moves up. I know our gaffer was not happy with the way I dance, but you know, I don't think he can dance either, so he might be <laughs> a little bit jealous of it, so but it's all right. I am saying people from Wales dance differently. This is a video of Pamoruka dancing. <laughs> <laughs> you would think he was a center forward striker scoring all the goals. I think he gets a bad rap for those dance moves. I think they're, they're good, but I think the, they're not as original as he thinks. If you took us to dancing with the stars, I think I'll probably win it easily. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Kakuta, you're starting today. Uh, this will be more starts in one year than you've had in your career combined. You getting tired or how do you feel mentally and physically right now as we're near the end of August? Actually, I feel great surprisingly. Uh, Sometimes people put a lot of pressure on young players, but his progression over the three years since I've been at this club has, has been phenomenal. Pedro Morales. Forward again for Kakuta Mane. It's Mane against Maya. Kakuta Mane. Kakuta Mane! The Whitecaps have the lead, and Kakuta Mane with a goal! We always struggle against Delhi because they're a top team, and at BC Place, I challenge my players to show them, you know, that we're really for real. Within five minutes, Kakuta put a ball in the bottom corner at home, BC Place, 22,000. Fantastic noise against the champs. 
I challenged him a couple of weeks later to do it away at LA Galaxy again. Kakuta Mane down that left channel, and he's in a good position to shoot, and Kakuta Mane has given the Whitecaps the lead as he did on April 4th. A super moment for the kid because it, it turned out to be the game winner, uh, but also for the club because at that point we'd never beaten LA uh, away from home. Kendall Waston coming back off that suspension in for an injured Pamo Dutra with a fractured cheekbone. He's faster with ball without the, without the ball. So without the ball, I actually beat him in the foot race, you know. I'm just saying though, but <laughs> but with the ball it's like with his ball in his feet is like with, Scoots, a little bit too high, Scoots, a little bit too high, Scoots. This addition. He's a special talent, the boy. He really is. And, you know, my job's to unearth, unlock that talent, uh, and make it consistent. And that's certainly what he's doing at the moment. Picks out Makuta Mane. Mane, it's a 1v1 run with Watson. Gets to the outside, got pulled back, keeps his feet. Yes, give it to him. Go, go, go! I would like him to score more goals, score more goals and more assists. players to ever play this game. When I get older, I will say, yeah, they're playing with him and that will really make me very proud. Well done, boys. Well done. Keep it there. He's done.